This here is the actual rust sound unit which started on fire in our house and uh, did damage to our house. Rust sound. The serial number on this particular unit is 03141888. I pre-removed the screws to speed the process of dis disassembly on camera. Lifting the cover, you can see it's a CAV 6.6. .6. Flame damage coming up and through this area onto the top cover. This is the power supply section of the Rust Sound audio amplifier. As you can see, this power supply is a heavy duty power supply capable of supplying multiple speakers and video outputs. Our experimental supplies and some of the other cameras are no more powerful than this supply. In this area, you can see with the circuit, the heat from underneath the circuit card burned through, starting to delaminate the circuit card and burn through. Removing this circuit card to get underneath, These banks of plastic connectors are made manufactured from flammable material which will burn and continue to burn after it ignites. Um, you can see the fire damage going down on the circuit card. Um, in these areas you can see how each section is banked the same and should have a group of connectors and a group of capacitors and a connector with some wires to it. In this end area, where the fire was already expanding over, the connectors are floating here off the board. They unsoldered themselves, and all the wire and all the wire has had the insulation burned off from the heat. These capacitors here physically exploded, and that's why you can see the um, strips of material radiating out from the center. Um, this is the area I pointed to on the opposite side of the board where the, the circuit card material had started to delaminate. Um, remember, this was on the top side, so it was the heat from the fire coming up into this area. Pointing down to the back side here. You can see where the heat started to demelt these uh, DC input connectors. And if you look closely, you can see more components that had desoldered, fallen on additional material, on additional wiring, and stuck. There's also physical part components. There's a capacitor hanging in free spot. And this whole lump of material is uh, it's partially dripped plastic and more connectors that have been on fire. As you can see this connector was starting to fall back into the cabinet. Once it, had, once it falls in the cabinet there's no guarantee that the fire couldn't start to go through some of these holes and come outside the cabinet. In this area I've broken off a one of the vi video connectors in its plastic material. In our next demonstrations um, we'll be demonstrating that heat source electronic components used as a heat source will start this plastic on fire and the fire will continue to burn. <laughs>